Hey, how are you doing? We're going to take a look at why your tablet may not be displaying correctly on your whiteboard with your widescreen projector. But before we start messing around with the display settings, I want to make sure that you're connecting your tablet to your projector using the HDMI cable and the micro HDMI to HDMI adapter that you got in your teacher package. I also want to make sure that you have set the aspect using the remote for your projector to either full or native. If you've done those two things and you're still getting an image that looks similar to this, then it's time to start playing around with the display settings for your tablet so that your projected image is filling the whiteboard. On this whiteboard, the image should be filling up the sides over here and here and going all the way to the top and to the bottom. So the projected view should be between these two lines and it's just not filling up the whole screen. So let's take a look at the display settings. The easiest way we can get to the display settings is to right click anywhere we want on the desktop and you will see this pop-up menu show up and we are going to select graphic properties right here. So go ahead and click on that. When we do that, we're going to get to the graphic control panel and we want to click on the display tile. Again, go ahead and do that. And these are the settings that we want to adjust. So there's three areas. We want to adjust the resolution. We want to adjust the refresh rate. And after we do those two things, we're going to have one more option down here. And that's the option that we're looking for that will correct our image of our desktop being centered on our whiteboard instead of having it fill the whole whiteboard up properly. So let's begin. First, we are going to adjust the resolution. The way we do that is we click on this little arrow here and the menu will pop down and we want to select 1280 by 800. Go ahead and do that and we'll move on. The next setting we want to adjust is the refresh rate. Again, click on the little arrow here and a drop down menu will show up and we want to change it from whatever it says, probably 59 hertz, so that it reads 60 hertz now. Again, go ahead and do that. Now that we've changed our resolution and we've changed our refresh rate, you'll see that there is one more option down here maintain display scaling and that's what we have been looking for so go ahead and check on that and see what happens when we check maintain display scaling you'll notice that now the image over here shows the desktop filling up the whole space and that's exactly what we want so that our desktop projects correctly onto our whiteboard one more step Click apply to apply the changes. When you do that, you're gonna get a pop-up window right here. And it's gonna say, hey, do you wanna save these changes? If you don't say yes, what's gonna happen is everything's gonna revert back to the way it was. So make sure you say yes. And if you have followed all the steps correctly and everything is working properly for you, you will now see that your image is filling up the whiteboard the way it should be. I hope this video has helped. If you have any more questions at all, please feel free to contact me. That's what I'm here for. Thanks for watching.